Hello, I'm Michael Young and this is Messick Fail. And I'm gonna walk through real quick how to add dimensions to a scale drawing in Adobe Acrobat Pro. First off, you wanna look for this measure tool. Um, if it's not in the sidebar here, you can click more tools and you'll find it in there. Um, and if you don't have this bar, you can also go up to here to view, tools, measure, and then it would say open there to open it. And then uh, this bar up at the top here, this menu will come up. Click on measuring tool. And then we're going to look for the distance tool. This is the one that we're going to use. After you select it, you have to calibrate it for the scale of the drawing. We can see right here that this is a 3 8 to one foot drawing. So we'll select our measuring tool and right click in the drawing space and change scale ratio and precision. And this is 3 8, so that's 0.375 inches um, equals one foot. So we'll change that from inches to feet. And we'll make the precision third decimal place since it's an eighth. And OK. And now it'll snap real nice to the endpoints of these lines. And you might have to zoom in some more to get it to be accurate. There we have 16.8 feet. And then you would have to convert that <coughs> to um, two inches. Um, from there. Uh, the next thing that you can do is you can also calculate area. Um, there's an area tool and a perimeter tool here. Um, but we're going to do area. Oftentimes you have to figure out <coughs> the square footage of a wall. Um, and this is probably the easiest way to do it if you have a scale drawing. Um, so this is set to 3 8, so same as before. And just try to click our points there. it and hover over that and there tells us the square footage of that wall so that's really really simple um, now as a comparison I'm going to show you how this works in a program called uh, Bluebeam review uh, it's made by Bluebeam it's called review uh, this is a program that's designed to work with PDFs um, specifically for the construction industry so it's it's really smooth like for zooming in and out you just roll the mouse wheel um, and click in the mouse wheel to drag just makes it a lot easier with Acrobat it's it doesn't work that way at least not for me um, and maybe that's a setting that somebody could show me how to do or I could just look it up. But um, <clears throat> so for this, we've got the measure tool. There's preset scales. We select 3 8 equals 1, 3 8 of an inch equals 1 foot. Um, you can tell it that you want to show the result in feet and inches or just inches, feet, yards, mi um, yeah, miles, kilometers, whatever. Uh, we'll go with feet and inches and get the length of this rafter that we need. Let's turn the arrow and drag this little yellow dot out. And there we go, 16 feet, nine and a half inches. And um, you can change, the, like if you want this to look like it's not a markup, like it's part of the drawing, you can change the coloring, font style, the arrow style. Um, you can change everything. Uh, so it's pretty handy. 
zoom out. Um, then we'll get the area of this wall section. So right there's area. What is it? They have diameter, angle. Yeah, so it's pretty sweet. It has all the tools you need to do this. Um, set to 3 8 equals 1 foot. And we'll go to the outside of this bracket. Shift to go straight down. And then we'll just kind of. Uh, uh, oh, that's pretty close. And hit enter. Oh, 609.81 square feet. So, uh, if I had the choice, I would definitely use review for this sort of thing. Um, it's just. That's just better. <laughs> um, so if you can get access to it, use it. If not, if you have access to um, Acrobat, use that. There's also a free program that I could do a video on that works, but I don't think you can pull dimensions. I think you can only do markup. So I'll have to look into that. But anyway, hope this was helpful. Uh, like and subscribe and leave comments if you have questions or recommendations. Thank you. Have a good day.